Well, this is a trigonometric identity in which I have to prove right hand side is equal to left hand side. Now, if you look at the right hand side, it is written sec a. Now, sec a is what? 1 by cos a. <coughs> now, in order to get the 1 by cos a in the left hand side, what we have to do? The first term does not have a cos a in the denominator. I have to create a cos a in the denominator. Tan a can be written as sin a by cos a, which is 1 and cos a and 1 plus sin a, we can write we multiply the denominator and the numerator by 1 minus sin a, we get um, 1 minus sin square a. This is a plus b to a minus b. Why I did it? Because if sin square a plus cos square a is equal to 1, 1 minus cos sin square a will become cos square a. And in the numerator there is cos a. So we nullify cos a with cos square a having a denominator of cos a. So, and the above the numerator becomes 1 minus sin a. So this becomes 1 minus sin a plus sin a by cos a which is equal to sec a which is the required thing to prove. What I am saying is not how it is not what to prove but why we did it this way. We have to get a cos a in the denominator and this is how I came to do it. Got it? <coughs>